now uh, you're going to show us how to decorate your balcony. It doesn't yeah. matter how much, how little or how big a space you Correct. have. You're going to show us how you can make it look amazing. Trace, size does not matter. <laughs> <laughs> really? So, I know. <laughs> so, you know, when my first condo had a tiny little balcony, mm -hmm. really small. It was four feet by six feet. So you are actually standing on a piece uh, that is four feet by six feet, yep. exactly like my first one was. Okay. And it was very much about designing the vertical space as well as the horizontal space. Right. So the wall that's next to you is by R&T Custom Cabinetry. I just had this piece built because oh, you cannot hang things on the on the facade of a building. You're not allowed to. Right. So having a piece like this just stand gives you the opportunity then to hang like the live wall that we saw on the tape. It's beautiful. Plus I did a, a little shelf below. And you can use that for, you know, uh, flowers, a bird feeder, a bar, yes. uh, you know, you know the important <laughs> stuff, right? Uh, and then on the actual uh, 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 surface itself, I yes. have one chair that actually opens up to a lounger. Oh, nice. A small table. Yeah. So this can actually be taken off. That ottoman can be taken off. It can be just a chair with the ottoman. But I want to talk about the turf. Yeah. So artificial turf is so big. Now, you know I have this on my terrace. It looks so good. Yeah. I absolutely love it. And turf has come such a long way from what we used to know. Yeah. You know, there's really uh, a whole bunch of different grades. And what I want to show is what a lot of people will know is when you go to the bigger box stores you'll find that really green turf which looks very artificial right but if you do something like this that has kind of the browns in it so it looks more natural more organic you're going to get that feel and this is really plush underfoot this feels absolutely amazing incredible now you have it in your place I do. Um, and your dogs can go out yeah. there and feel really good right. and comfortable right they don't I mean your dogs yes. are kind of like mine they don't pee indoors yeah hi baby <laughs> hi Hello. Yeah. <laughs> but if you do live in a condo mm -hmm. and you do have a tiny one like this guy yes. that you have right here, they can actually pee. Yes, absolutely. So, oh, shh. Okay, I'm just going to put him over there. This is, the ultra <laughs> this is the ultra base. Yes. So this actually goes under the, uh, under the turf, and what's great about it is that's drainage. So, right. you know, if Doggy goes, does his duty. It's not uh, the worst thing ever. Not the worst thing ever, and it completely drains out. Yeah. So that's really great. And you can hose it down. Hose it down. This is, I'm telling you, the, uh, the spring comes, I just hose down my lawn. I have the best lawn in the world. <laughs> <laughs> Don't have to do anything with it. It's fantastic. That's awesome. Okay, so if you go a little, shh. So if you go a little bit further, a little bit you bigger. You a little bit more space. A little bit more space. You've kind of upgraded in life, right? Yes. I, I can add uh, another chair here. I have this for company. But I'm also going to move over here because now I have a dining area as well. So we have from here all the way to where you are. Correct. Okay. Now, the dining area, what I've done here is I've done a bistro set, but a bistro set that's actually raised up. And that's really important because it makes the space feel larger. You're not, you're not seeing the sturdiness and the heaviness of the table low to the ground. Right. Right? So it feels a lot airier. A bistro set is great. This is easy to move around. These are great. You can bring them over. If you want to move things around, you can have more additional seating if you do have the space. Yep. But keep in mind that most condo balconies nowadays are no deeper than what we have right here. So we wanted to keep it true to form. So when people are watching at home, they know that this is something they can actually do. Lovely. Behind here, I've done this screen. Mm -hmm. The screen is fantastic because again, if you can't hang things on a wall, which most condos you cannot, to have something like this and then do almost like a live wall on it or hang plants off it, fantastically easy and you can get more traditional this one of course is more contemporary I love this look it's all about making it it's all about personalizing it right mm -hmm. so if you're if you're stuck with the two concrete walls and you need to find a way to put some art up or some some plants mm -hmm. this screen and this wall very good way to do it and They're it does solutions. it it's so easy and then of course uh, a bar <laughs> I have to have a real bar <laughs> um, the, the challenge with a bar bar is when you buy a bar it's large it's long yes. it doesn't fit so this is actually a tray table you can actually style it as a bar it's but good. what's great about it is you pick it up you can serve you can use it it's multifunctional yeah. so small spaces multifunction of course is key you can fold that right up and bring it inside if you want as well which That's, is lovely yes okay so now we have all this space <laughs> we have done really well in life we're living and large. <laughs> we're living large and we have a really large balcony so i've added the little settee here but the, again the depth stays the same yeah. so to do a beautiful settee like this that's very streamlined mm -hmm. small arms lower back is really kind of uh, conducive to what it is that we're doing here in terms of living and uh, and size but the fun thing is is you look at these tables and they look like faux concrete yeah, they do. what these actually are are covers for propane tanks are so they? yes so think outside of the box it's always about thinking outside nice. of the box yeah and what's great about them is that they have the handles on the side so they're easy to pick up move yeah. around if you want to bring them in, in the winter although they are completely fine in the winter as well outside heavy? not at all oh, they're good. faux concrete so oh yeah. that is great yeah okay good so now you have the balcony space for everything you might 
possibly want. Uh, we want to thank Inside Out for the furniture, Garden City Grounds for the Sin Lawn Turf, and Devron for the live picture on the wall. Yes. Thank you, Sean. You're welcome. <laughs>